This is my winter one. This is my summer one. Look how that just flows down. Yes, sis. Come closer. Yes, girl. Yeah. That is why you have to take care of your skin during summer. You have to update your skincare routine. My skincare routine in the winter months are completely different to my skincare routine in the summer months. Hi, lovelies. Welcome to Valenzo Skincare. If you want bright skin, hydro skin, glowing skin, you're in the right channel. So hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell. Let's get right into it, okay? I've got brilliant tips for you guys. Brilliant tips is gonna make you glow. It's gonna make him text you back during the summer. Now, since I know we got a lot of problems during the summer, like sunburn, hyperpigmentation, people not wearing sunscreen, but that's a whole other topic for a whole other day. I ain't got time today to do that. That's a whole other topic, but we, we'll talk about it soon, don't worry. And also, him not texting you back, but sis, stay woke though. Stay woke, okay? stay woke <laughs> so summer is really hot time of the year and it's very humid and it's really hot and it can actually give you a lot of skin issues such as acne epigmentation premature signs of aging if you're not protecting your skin since you know what i mean but we're going to talk about how to do all that and how to achieve that bright even skin tone glowing skin during the summer months okay let's go the tips to help me glow during the summer and also now they're going to become the tips that are going to help you glow during the summer okay I know you're probably thinking, sis, I'm going to be indoors, don't worry, don't worry. You can glow from your kitchen, your kitchen table, your balcony, anywhere you want to glow from, sis, I got you. Guys, you're not going to be wearing your winter coat in the summer, are you? So your skin really shouldn't have to wear a winter coat either. So I thought your cleanser. I always recommend to switch your cleanser up when the summer months come around, right? In the winter months, I tend to use a cream or milk cleanser, but in the summer months, I swap it to a gel cleanser. It's a lot lightweight and also does the job of cleaning my skin off impurities and debris at the end of the day. So swap out your, your cleanser, guys. So the reason behind this is that during the summer months, it's more humid and it's a lot hotter. So your skin produces more oil during the summer months. So it's always good to swap out your, your heavy base cleanser to a lightweight cleanser. So one of the main things that contribute to wrinkles and fine lines and premature aging, guess what, baby? The sun. The sun. So SPF. SPF, SPF, SPF. If I have to throw it at you, SPF is so important. You have to use sunscreen. When I say SPF on sunscreen, I don't just mean something like a 30%. I don't know <laughs> with any sunscreen below 50. Okay, I might like, I might use like a 45 or like a 40, but below that, uh-uh. I'm not, nah, no sis, you, you're not gonna sell it to me. Anything, broad spectrum, any sunscreen that's going on my face and my body has to be broad spectrum sunscreen to give me the maximum protection that I need. And also don't forget the importance of sunscreen is not just for your face, it's also for your neck, your hands, your legs and your whole body. You have to keep the whole area protected. And also remember to reapply your sunscreen every two to three hours during the day. Okay, because you know why? You're sweating during the day, you're in the pool or you're walking around and you're wiping your face, you're wiping away the sunscreen and you're wiping away the protection that it's giving you. So always reapply guys, okay? There is one ingredient that I literally put in my skincare routine from January to December. It does not, it, I really do not even swap it out during the winter or the summer months. That is an antioxidant. I love a good antioxidant and my favorite one is vitamin C. If you haven't watched my video on vitamin C, Click up after this and go watch my video on vitamin C so I can talk I talk about all the benefits it can do for your skin. So I love vitamin C during the winter months, during the summer months, and so on and so forth. Vitamin C is so great. Vitamin C is my favorite antioxidant because it helps me fight free radicals, it prevents my skin from happy pigmentation, and it's really, really beneficial. It helps brighten my skin tone and it's brilliant. I really highly recommend that you look for a moisturizer or serum that contains vitamin C that's gonna be really beneficial for you during the winter and the summer months as well. And you're gonna get that glow because your skin is gonna look so bright and so even toned, it's gonna to be beautiful, okay? <laughs> Add an exfoliation step to your skincare routine. Exfoliation is so important during the summer months as well in the winter months. So that's why I highly recommend you to hide an exfoliation step into your skincare routine. So I'd recommend you incorporating HS and BHS into your skincare routine to really help you do a good, nice cleaning of your pores and get rid of any impurities and debris that could be blocked in your pores. And also you're gonna feel nice and smooth during the summer because exfoliation is gonna be so great. You're gonna see such nice, even skin tone. I actually heard someone tell me that moisturizers don't work during the summer. Eh, that's wrong. But you need to upgrade your moisturizer. That's another one. 
upgrade your moisturizer. So in the winter months, I tend to use a heavier moisturizer than I do in the, in the summer months, okay? Because I've got combination skin, so I'm oily all over my teeth and oily down here and around my chin area. So I always recommend to change your moisturizer up as the seasons change as well. I'm gonna show you an example right now, okay? So this is the moisturizer I would use during the winter months. If you can see that, I'm trying, let me try and block the light for you. Can you see that guy? It's a lot thicker and it gives me really great hydration. But now, let me show you my moisturizer during the summer months, okay? I don't know if you can see that. Look at the consistency of these two different moisturizers. Look, this is my winter one, this is my summer one. Look how that just flows down easily, it's lighter. And watch, right here, summer one, winter one. Now, during the summer months, I never use a moisturizer. Even in the winter, I never use a moisturizer that doesn't have SPF. So keeping my skin protected from UV rays is so important to me, even in the winter months. But that doesn't mean I don't follow up with a sunscreen afterwards. I also follow up with a sunscreen after applying my moisturizer. <laughs> now, how to cool off. Cool enough during the summer months is so important to me because this can be so hot, especially in the summer. I travel a lot. I'm doing a lot of vacations all over Europe and different parts of the States. And I never leave or travel without having a little spray mist okay okay a cool face mist does wonders for your skin it literally keeps it hydrated helps suit inflammation and also gives you that nice dewy look that everyone kind of so invest in a really good face mist is so important let me show you what i mean yes yeah, sis come closer yes girl yes keep yourself hydrated i never leave my house without a cold bottle of water or just a nice bottle of water just gonna keep me refreshed during the hot summer days or when i'm walking down the street i'm going to the beach or going anywhere and also it's really gonna help me get rid of those toxins also keeping you hydrated and helping you cool your body temperature at the same time water baby water sunscreen water sunscreen water <laughs> and that's it guys that's all the going tips um give your comments down below if you guys have other tips that you guys do and you follow during the summer months that helps keep you glowing it helps keep giving you that nice supple nice plump skin let us know spill the tea as well okay we want to know okay and thanks so much for tuning into this episode and i hope you guys love the content i love you guys so much thank you for your support and i hope you guys are all safe ah, thanks lovely